But let's jump in to Valheim and try to find the second boss. Or just explore the... The wilds. Not the wilds. Thinking of the other game. Explore the Black Forest. <laughs> what country is this kind of music from? I'd say it's more like Nordic. I think they were going for like a Vikings kind of vibe to it. That's my guess. Not sure though. So maybe you might want to look for uh, Nordic instrumental music violin. <laughs> that might be something that turns up this style of music. Oh. Which means an easier thing you could search for and get it is Skyrim soundtrack, because Skyrim is also Nordic. And it does have some chill tunes like this in it, so. Oh, there, there's some baddies. Time for this inferior weapon. Hey, screw you guys. Oh, I'm almost out of food. Can you tell I don't block a lot by the fact that my blocking skill is one? <laughs> So I might as well just put all this stuff down that I just got. It still gets me that whatever sound that is, that really sounds like... Like a creeper, that... <laughs> kind of sound. Every time. Okay, and reminder to self, I don't ever need to get more food. <laughs> Maybe not ever, but not for the long time. Okay. Is it night? Should I go to bed? <sighs> I'm ready to go out for my adventure. Go straight to best. Second best game? Skyrim, it has more story. It's more story driven. This is more exploration driven. Although, no, Skyrim's pretty exploration, -driven, but it has more story. This is more just survival, I guess. Dream of an adventure. Is that what it said? Why is there blue stuff here? Let's deal with this. What? Is this game also going to be weird? <laughs> Start throwing quantum physics at me? It... Were you saying that because I was sleeping? I, uh... Speaking of Dream of an Adventure, it reminds me of one of my favorite songs called Dream of Flight. So good. If you've never heard of it, it's good. Heed these words of Ulf, poor settler in Strint. Did we read this one? We find here good stone. Yes, we have. Yeah, we have. Black Forest is down here. Hello, boar. No! Don't use your hands, man. Use your tools. There you go. Guy has a... <laughs> spear. <laughs> and the shield proceeds to fight with his bare hands. <laughs> what are you doing? 
Oh wow, you can see the difference in color from the black forest to the meadows. That's crazy. That's cool. I really like that. But now we're black forest material. We beat the first boss last time. It was crazy. We only had to fight it one time. Which is even crazier. I don't know if it was... Can I cut these? Oh, I can cut these massive trees. Oh, look at those trees in the distance. They look so beautiful. Timber! Fur cone. Screw you guys. I'm trying to cut trees here. Blueberries. These are new. I don't want them. Excuse me, sir. This weapon sucks. <laughs> I'm eager to switch away from from the spear because it's real. It really is. So far, the worst weapon. <laughs> it's so precise of where you have to hit. They need to improve the hitbox of that thing. Because if they want it to be a viable weapon for people... Oh, the colors. The colors! That's... This... <laughs> That's essentially- oh no. Fog. Back. That's essentially me the, playing this game. It's just me screaming out how beautiful I think it is. And that's it. Oh. I oh, this looks different. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> looks great. So much. Skelly boy! <gasps> oh, they're... Are they skelly couple? They looked like they were holding their hands together. Aw, skelly couple. I don't wanna... I don't wanna hunt the skelly couple. It's kinda cute. Skellies deserve love. <gasps> Uh-oh. Something weird. Oh, they're fighting. Skellies and gray whatevers fighting. I can use that as a distraction. While I go search for whatever that is. Yeah, you guys keep fighting. I'm gonna sneak on by. With my booty. Booty booty. Oh, he doesn't do the booty. Hey, what in the world is this? What I'm talking about this weapon sucking. Okay, you know. This is why they were attacking me so much. Okay. I lured them away. Check this out. So 
We're luring them, luring them, luring them. Run back. And... Wait a minute. I know a secret. How many of them are afraid of fire? So many bindings. I'm trying so many buttons right now. There we go. Got it. Okay, I'm gonna run away for a little bit. Because I just want a few of them following me. Ooh. Parrots. Alright, perfect. Okay, they're all kind of running away. Perfect. This is perfect. <laughs> See what I'm talking about with this weapon? Sucks. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna... It's so much better. It's so much better. Sure, it's weaker. It's so much better, though. <laughs> I can hit so much more consistently. Oh. Screw the other weapon. It sucks. <laughs> I came back from talking to my brother and I'm, and I'm still on the stream. Yeah. We went to a new game. We went from traveling into the stars into traveling into a black forest. And I'm just killing. I just killed a whole nest of a mob. goodies for me here. Okay, I should probably put out my... There we go. What does this say? Ooh, this is a long one. Let all who read this read me beware of the Grey Dwarfs, the Skulkers in the darkness, the Soulless Ones. They are born from rot and rainfall. They spring like mushrooms from the smoking soil. There is nothing on their tongues, or behind their eyes. Those who fear nothing should still fear them. When the soul of a murderer or great sinner rots under the ground, it makes a hollow cyst, which draws rock and wood and moss to it. It gathers up the peat into flesh, braid reeds into bone, and takes rags for skin. It should not walk, but when the night comes, it walks. Should you read this, see one with a sword to your hand, lance it, and let it out. Or put it to the torch, for it fears the flame. Which makes sense, I guess, since they're made of wood. Let's see. I feel like there's still some... Some of them who remain back here. Want to finish? Yeah, the two, the two granddaddies. Now that I'm a pro at this. Ooh, ooh. Oh, 
Oh, you you dead. You dead. Okay, I would definitely want to remove as much of their stuff as possible because hopefully with this they're gonna attack my house less Because it's annoying The fact that they come to my house and keep attacking me. I don't want that. I want to be free and happy And when all you want is happiness Nothing worse than Thistle. New material. Thistle. Nothing worse than having soulless monsters skulking after you, attempting to murder you in the night. That's what I say. I have to be honest, it's kind of hard to take the last game out of my head. <laughs> it's so thought-provoking. <laughs> I wonder how I'm gonna sleep. I want to know more. By the way, I found a dungeon in this game not too long ago, so maybe I should I should go explore that, because that's still in the meadow, so it's a level easier. I should be able to just breeze through it. But... Here I am, exploring new places. I always hear stuff moving in the... I think it's by design. Bet there's a bunch of skelly boys in here. No, not skelly boys. Let's try this food. Hello. How am I walking? Uh. Oh. Okay, guys. Give me a second. I need to figure out how to do this. What? Screw you guys. I can hit multiple of them with this weapon. This is a, the best weapon. to say about PC gaming is I don't understand how people get used to using the number keys just for like using their stool picking their inventory because it's kind of hard <laughs> especially when it gets to the super high numbers what are you supposed to do when you get to the super high numbers are you just supposed to stop moving or use your mouse hand? How are you reaching over properly? Oh, this makes me think of um, Return of the Jedi. Because it, it has a similar biome look to it. Man, it's crazy that even though, you know, it's still trees, but it looks so different now. 
It has a completely different vibe to it in this game. Oh, there's another. Are those skelly boys? Those be skelly boys. Uh oh. I didn't want to do that. I should probably return to. Those be skelly boys. Alright. Okay, I should probably head back. I'm going to need to make a new fort. A new house. In this area. Because it's going to be too much to go back every time. It's just too far. I might build something here-ish, because it seems to be, like, top of the world, so it's easy to go to any direction that I may want. Oh, here it already connects to where I used to be, so maybe I'll take this route. Might be a little bit easier on me. say it. I say it way too much. <laughs> not gonna say it. Black Forest. The first time I heard the term Black Forest was in Overwatch, which you can say, wait, you didn't know what Black Forests were until you played Overwatch? Not really. Um... So every time it comes up, that's what I think about. I think of Overwatch. <laughs> and I think of the narrator saying it. Now entering Black Forest. There are more baddies here. Did I have... I have a bunch of blueberries right next to my house and I didn't even know. There's so much material here. Ah, they're coming for me. <laughs> Fog is such... It can be used to create such good atmosphere. Remember when games were so proud they eliminated completely their fog? So there was literally no fog anywhere because that was seen as, like, inferior graphics because they used to use fog to hide, like, things further away. Man, I'm glad they're past that. I'm glad that they're back to using fog because fog can have... Obviously, it can be too strong, especially in the sense of when they were hiding stuff. Sometimes games really couldn't handle something and the fog was way too strong. <laughs> But, for the most part, I'm pretty glad that they actually... Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out where to put some of these things. That they went back and are doing that stuff again, because it looks good. <laughs> That's the truth. It can look good. They, obviously, you can do it a bad way. Like, I can... There's always a bad way of doing things, but... Can that only look good? Oh, I'm filling up my storage. Yeah, this is another seed. Is this another seed? I'm putting it here. This is another plant. Where's my resin? Yeah, the resin is up. I'm filling up my space so quickly. It's funny, I spent so much time making this house, and now I'm probably gonna just have to move to another one. 
just because it might become too far. I'm gonna repair all my stuff. I still don't know what I use to repair things. That's... this is it. Alright. Into the black forest we... Excuse me. I can't believe... I can't believe that the microphone can actually pick that up. Not a loud burper. But <laughs> I always see it on the meter. It goes boop. <laughs> Not that I'm concerned, I just think it's funny. It's like, oh. It's interesting to see how sound works, because I feel like things that we consider a lot lower in volume sometimes are not. It's just the tone of it that makes our brain think that it was a lot lower in volume. So, a lot of times, lower notes tend to have... Oh, thank you, Bob. Thank you. Tend to have... We tend to think of it as softer volume-wise, but many times, the lower volume is just as... loud as the higher-pitched volume. That's why the THX sound, the... The whole thing, it sounds like it's getting louder, but the whole thing that that's trying to do is show you that it can do a whole range of tones, but they're not changing the volume. So when it goes... It's staying the same, but it sounds like it's getting louder. And when I found that that was what was happening and people told me, I was like, whoa, that's rad, bro. <laughs> I didn't say it like that, but you can imagine. Oh, I've been here. I need to explore north. I'm back in the meadows. Boo. How far do the meadows go? It's interesting that the biomes mix together. It's not just like... Biome here! Biome here! They kind of like are mixed a little bit. Which I think is really cool. One could say, more natural. Scaly boy, scaly boy, what will you do with me, scaly boy? Screw you, scaly boy. I'm gonna aim for you. Kelly boy. Yeah, be careful now. Kelly boys not give me anything? They give me bones. But I saw a third Skelly boy. <gasps> I found another dungeon. Enter the dungeon. Burial chambers.
You know what? I feel like I shouldn't explore it. Not in this area. I should go back to the meadows if I'm gonna explore a dungeon. <laughs> what? They respawn? Screw you, skelly boy. We need to go north. Oh, there's a different, there's another. Okay. Let's see if I can hit it. Make sure there aren't any baddies around. Da da da. Da da da. Da da da. Man, my shots are going sideways. Uh oh. Uh oh. Sir, sir. Okay, probably. Need better weapons. drawing on my booty it looks like a little skull face can you see that it looks like a little skull on my booty <laughs> it's got a skull booty or a booty skull hello dear don't mind me I like that when you run, you go <laughs> perpendicular to the surface you're walking on, or running on. <laughs> it looks like you're defying the laws of physics. Which, hey. The faster you go, you know what they say. Look at these mini trees growing. They're not called mini trees, Ross. They're saplings. Okay. How far away am I? Ooh. Okay. Actually went pretty far. Is this some meadows in the Black Forest? Yeah. See, I, this is what I'm saying. I like that. I like that. Did something just die over there? Things just constantly dying over there. Not gonna approach. Not while I am naked and afraid. <gasps> the deer came to commune with me. use this as an, a good opportunity. Oh, scaly boy. Scaly boy. Stop looking at me. Oh, scaly boy. It's interesting to see that the skeletons and 
the gray whatever, the gray dwarfs, um, fight each other. Black, back in mad, can talk. As long as it's deer, not anything else. I wonder if there are other friendly animals. Not just friendly, but like neutral animals. I'd be interested in meeting them. This soul. I want to grab as many of these as possible. I feel like I'll be able to build something cool. So I will not approach. I will not be approaching the nest. Almost out of a torch. Booty. What are you saying about booty right now? Ooh, look at that booty walk. Oomch, 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 oomch. Look at that booty. Oomch, oomch. More thistle. More thistle. Okay, so, thank you. I, I like that Ark pops in from time to time and gives me some good tips. Because he told me that I'm looking for another stone that will guide me. Will guide my- there's a lot of nests here. Will guide my journey. I'm looking for a tiny red stone that tells me where I need to go. Oh, earlier? Okay. I mean, he still does have a pretty good booty. Joe Smithson? Oof. He was a catch in his village. But then he had to go. Oh, copper deposit. Hmm. If only I had a pickaxe. Crafting. See, I can only make a tanning rack. The chopping block. I still cannot make the next. The next. Le oh, Sean Connery died recently. I was so sad. <laughs> I love Sean Connery. At least he died very old. It's like Sean Connery. The first James Bond. And... Indiana Jones is a dad. Like, you, you don't get... A better resume than that. Sure, he has done a lot more than just that. But, ooh, having those two. Okay, so we arrived at water, which is good. Because now we know the upper bounds of the island. Oh, there's an, a river, like a decently big river that goes inland. Very reedy. A lot of reeds. Reeds! I see you, Skelly Boy. That Skelly Boy wants to come for me. Come on, Skelly Boy. Hit me. Wow, really? <laughs> you gonna try doing that that far?
stupid lag. Messed me up. Skelly boy? Skelly boy? Skelly boy? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh boy. There we go. That should be it. Oh, he almost got me. If I rest, do I heal faster? You know what I could do? I could create multiple ports around the eye. Don't tell me that's a, a reading stone. Is that what I need right there? But yes, I could create multiple ports around the island. Could then work for me to just traverse between all of my different encampments. will create my maritime nation. They shall be the best. Let's see what this is. Oh, uh, this is explaining the Grey Dwarfs again. Okay. Well, it seems like each biome has their own stones that it creates. By the way, I'm going to start heading home. Dang it. So maybe we could tin deposit. No, that tin was metal. There. <laughs> A nice little bay. Maybe I could do something with this bay. Increasingly harder. How much wood do I have on me? Two. <laughs> Is there a nest here? Is there a lonesome baddie? Nope, not lonesome. Hello. This might be a great place for a port. Seeing what I'm seeing. <laughs> That's a big boy. <laughs> um. Yeah. 
if you want to stay away from that, I'm going to see if I can cut this pine. I'm just going to start maybe building here. Oh, he looks like he's coming towards me. That's a posse. Hey, big boy. I don't want trouble. <laughs> oh, no. This is not good. At least I am going down the coast. Oh no, I have to swim. I don't swim very fast. I don't walk in water very fast either. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, I seem to be getting down to known territory, given the map. How in the world was I out there in the water? How is the water known territory? Explain to me. Okay, I think... Oh, it's where I flew in from. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that was slightly scary. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Can I not? Can I... Am, am I gonna die? Please. Okay. Because I know you can drown if you're just out in water and you run out of stamina. I really didn't want that to happen. Okay, so at least we're back... ...to a known area. I have a feeling that by the time I get to to my base, it's gonna be day again. And that's why I should really work on building something new. I think that's where, if you're playing out in a group, that's where it comes in handy to have more people. You can spread out and start building different bases across the land. So then it, it's immediately easier for you to traverse it. Even if you're doing, you know, your own boss runs and your own things, it's just so much easier if you have more people. See those baddies. It's gonna keep running. I can. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I think when I'm cold and or wet, my stamina regenerates more slowly. It's something like that. I don't remember exactly if it is that. Oh, hello. Note to self, also make more torches. <laughs> and there's no real incentive for you to fight anyone. I guess you do your ability with a club or with a spear does improve the more you fight or use it, but it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't necessarily need to be in a fight and just be using it in general. Need to make 
new spear. Oh, I left my house open. Unless someone came in here. Really? It's never been a problem. There we go. But the warmth of their memory lingered. I just feel though, one of the negatives of playing with people, it's not a very big negative, but is that you can't time jump like that. You, you're stuck in whatever time you are. <laughs> There's no time skipping. So, you can't sleep in advance time. Is how is that going to work for the, all the other people playing? And that's one thing with any survival game or any game that you're playing with people that has always been like, eh, to me. It's like, sometimes I just want to sleep. <laughs> I don't want to play in the night. Sometimes you have to, if you're playing with people. Here we go. This, nope. Bones are not... Do I not have any bone fragments? so many of these. Did I have resin? I just have bone fragments. <laughs> when you have too many chests. Nope. 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 I guess I looked at the bone fragments multiple times and just didn't. Okay. Um... Prepared everything. Flint Spear, which is horrible, Wood Tower Shield, Rough But Heavy, Shield, Simple Wooden Shield, Block Power, yeah, can't even parry with it, Antler Pickaxe. I'm making that. <laughs> I'm making that. I need some wood and my antler. Let's see if there's anything else new that I can make. Also seems to be a great weapon. Fire arrows, flint head arrows, flint axe, stone axe, everything else is normal. We'll see. Also, if I wanted to upgrade my club, because it's the best weapon. Spear sucks. It does a lot more damage, but it sucks. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> I need five bony bones. Alright. Time to get my bony bones. Out of here. 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 Club. What do I need to... Can I... Okay, I can't even upgrade. I was gonna check if I could upgrade the... Ooh, I can upgrade the bow. So right now, it does 12, this is going to do 18 now. Can I not upgrade it? Club. I need 10 bone. That's fair. It's, it's going to be way better. I'm, I'm honestly just retiring. The spear. The spear sucks. For now. We'll see. Maybe there will be moments where the spear becomes good again. Because they're still changing the game so much. It might be a thing that they fix. This is right now. So what do I need to upgrade my crude bow? I need 
Four leather scraps and one deer hide. Okay, I definitely have that. And we're gonna upgrade. Root bow. I guess I could upgrade my leather tunic as well, but I... Oh no, I guess not. There we go. A lot of these require bony bones. Why would you want a better hammer? Yeah, that doesn't make sense why you would want a better hammer. I guess for durability. Uh, it doesn't seem like it's worth it to me. Block power 30. I need resin leather scraps. <laughs> I'm short one on leather scraps. Okay. So what I'm gonna do... <laughs> thank you, thank you. It is a lot of chests. What I'm gonna do... Is... Take some wood with me. Take 100 wood with me. What time is it? Okay. It's like morning ish. What I'm gonna do. So, this. If the island kind of goes like this, I wanna put. Okay, so house. So I want to put one right there. Boom. Boom. Right at the heart of it. Maybe a little bit farther south. Maybe right there. But that's where we're going to try to get to. That's our plan. That's our plan. Oh, I was gonna test it on rocks. Test my antler thing. Ooh! Ooh! Air warrior! Oh, where? <laughs> Bird, where are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> you have crafted a pickaxe! Rock forest is rich in minerals! There you can find copper in the ground and tin lining the ocean shore. Now go forth and strike the earth. I wonder if that's a reference to... You know, not everything needs to be a reference, but... I wonder if that's a reference to... Uh... Hurrah! If that's a reference to, uh, Shovel Knight. Because I think they say something almost like that, if not that. Like, strike the earth, or something like that. Shovel Knight, he is Shovel Knight. He's a shovel, and he is a knight. I would sing that a lot while I was playing Shovel <laughs> That's an old. That's an old video. You can go find that in my archives. <laughs> Me playing and singing. stuff up. It's 
been really foggy lately. Ooh, that's a hitch. They need to figure out a way for the game to save. That's less hitchy. It really does. Ooh. Welcome to Black Forest. I'm wet. Oh, it's raining. No. Oh. Right below it now. Oh, I'm actually going perfectly in the direction I need to go. So keep going. It actually looks cool with the shield on my back. I like it. Ooh, that's a drop. Ellie boys? No. This gray dwarfs. I thought I heard people talk. That's a lot of mushrooms. Oh wow, this might actually end up being the perfect place for this. sort of construction, kind of where I was planning to build my stuff. Hello. I will take these. Here, baddies. Hello, baddie. Oh, there's a village right here. I'll actually build on the village. I'll make my life way easier. Hey, we found a village! I shall build on this village. And I shall make this pig mine. By giving him... A mush. Hey, little piggy, piggy, piggy. There you go. All right. We're gonna rehabilitate this village. good starting point for me. There we go. Now we begin. I'm not going to fix the walls, but I will fix the floor because the floor is useful to me. The walls I'm going to redo. Someone is attacking? Excuse me. 
I hear you attacking. Oh no, people are being attacked. So, there's a big giant roaming around, which is my bigger worry, honestly. Hey, I broke the bed. Perfect. That's what I was wondering. I could do. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> this is gonna be a problem. Again. Alright. I'm actually gonna use this tent as my base, I guess. Because it's more central. Or I could do both. Yeah, it fits everything. Great. Um, go into repair mode. Well, actually, now that it, it can hit everything, I'll just keep doing that. Again. I'm actually gonna go with a completely different style this time around. I'm gonna go with something that is more Viking-like, more like the ones, the pre-built. This, are you serious, guys? I can't. Uh, I can't be alone in a village, constructing stuff for one second before you guys come and. Uh, sometimes these guys. Let me tell you. Well, I love building in these games, so this is gonna be very exciting for me. Hopefully you guys enjoy watching me build. That is what I will do. So what I'm gonna do here I need my hope. Nope, that's not a hope. I'm gonna level the ground so that it is as you would hope level. Doesn't seem very level to me. gonna work. Six. gonna get a lot of wood from just tearing some of these apart. Oh, I'm tired.
We'll start here. I feel like I do need to close a house just because. Otherwise, the monsters are going to start. So I'll start here. Monsters won't mess with me for a little while, at least. And I am going to follow the building styles that we were talking about. Of, I wonder. Those are 45s. Oh, the pig is happy. Um, those are 45s. fine though. Like right here. Nope, not stone. I guess technically stone, but Oh, you usually give me stone. <laughs> I'm a rebel. I'm jumping over everything. So yes, this will be... It's quite dark. Yeah. That's one thing they need to add to this game is... A gamma. Or gamma. Gamma. Uh... Setting. Because otherwise it is very... Pig! You get out of here destroying my stuff. How did I do it? Hey, there we go. Did it again. Yeah, I feel like this would be pretty dark for you guys. Really, pig?
Listen. I don't want to be bothered. While I'm building. I just want to build. You come near me with your weird gray whatever skin or whatever. It's not gonna end well. Your dead skin wood skin. I see you coming. Dude. Really? I don't know what they expect. I tell them. I tell them it's not gonna be easy on them. They keep doing it. Maybe they just don't understand. What's gonna happen to them? Now you guys can be saying, Roz, that's a mighty big area you're flattening there. I'm gonna be like, yeah. Yes it is. What is my plan? You might never know. Excited to build this. Really excited. I'm for some building. talking about. I want it. It's a little bit lower. Would be quite nice. I think I'm getting it. I wish instead of... I wish I could use the scroll wheel. There's just this little mound too. <laughs> right here. I wish that instead of the scroll wheel, I could... I mean, instead of having to use the numbers, I could use the scroll wheel to pick what I want to use. Because I'm that kind of person. I just like not having to really move my hands a lot. And sadly, you know. Of 
forest is moving. Um, screw you guys. At least I moved it. At least I moved it. Yeah, being on fire doesn't really affect me anymore. I'm kind of just like, hey, I'm on fire. Monsters will lay siege to your camp from time to time. Strength of arms doesn't guarantee your victory in this situation. Build a strong defense to weather out the storm. Okay, thank you, bird. Good to know. I have to build another. Good thing my hammer wasn't out. Otherwise, it could have been, it could have posed a problem. Oh, where is my crafting rack? Bam. Now, uh oh. Where are my guides? Um. Building. Where are my guides? Actually, this is perfect for the house. Um. Bam. Nope. Bam. Bam. Gonna be a big one. This one, I am definitely going more of the Viking style then, and I'm gonna be making a more traditional Viking house. Time to gather some wood. We deforested another area, and now we're bringing deforestation to this place. Probably. I'm glad I'm at least able to cut this tree. Oh. 
Oh, oh, whoa, whoa! As long as it doesn't fall on my house. <laughs> that would be bad. Guy. Oh, I definitely need another torch. <laughs> Not looking good for me, torch wise. Ooh, double hits. There we go. That's a big trunk. I mean, stump. This log. Oh. How much do I have? That should be enough for a little while. temporary one in here as well so I can build stuff and not have to worry about not having a roof um torch oh good thing I have some resin torch I'm gonna put one torch in the chest Just stay here. I'll put a bunch of stuff in the chest, actually. Looks, looks pretty good. Pig, get pig! It's leaving. Good. Leave. I have no interest in you destroying my house or on killing you. I am quite happy where I am. There needs to be no... Oh, are you guys serious? I just want to build my house. Now you run! I'm glad that at least they give me a lot of stuff I do need. <sighs> Alright. I believe I am done.
still have some time to cut some more trees down. Okay. <laughs> I was like, I'm drinking. Please don't fall towards me. So yeah, this is a rhythm I'm more okay with, so with a lot of, like I was mentioning when I first started playing this, a lot of survival games, you don't really have a goal, uh, you, you're just mining and building and blah blah blah. I like this, where I still have, you know, possibly if I wanted, infinite amount of time to mine, but, but, it can be, in between them, I can be like, I'm working towards something. I'm working towards fighting a boss. I'm working towards... So, to me, I like this rhythm a lot better. Where it's not just building, 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 mining, mining, mining. It's building, 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 mining, 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 and then boss. Like, you're, you're building towards a boss, so you're strong enough to get to a boss. Like, right now, the only reason I'm building this house, I'm not building for the sake of building. I'm building it because I know that I need to get to this boss, which is in this area somewhere, and for me to travel back and forth is just not really convenient. So, there's a reason behind my building, and... Now, I can still take as much time as I want, which I will, which is fun for me, but at least I'm doing it with a purpose. And it's the doing it with a purpose that really attracts me. That's what makes it worth for me. Worth it. Alright, here we go. Alright, and I'll probably be stopping soon too. It's pretty late. I need to be in tip-top shape tomorrow, because we're streaming again tomorrow. And I have a lot to do. So, probably just finish building, maybe the walls. Yeah, again, I'm guessing this is very dark once again. aggressive slant just because it's too short I do I am going to keep this one one height even though it is usually very short to keep things like this one one square height but I'm gonna make it more like this instead
And up top, we'll do the X. Boom. Now we can close it off. This. Oh, whoops. Do the same thing to the other side. And bam. Put the X on top. Now can actually start building one of these. At least two across it'll hold. Which in turn <laughs> allows me to do one of these. Yeah. Releases some of the stress from it. There we go. Am I out of ward? Man. I just need so much wood for all these things. I said I was gonna stop. I said I was gonna stop. But I'm not stopping. All these games. The games I'm really enjoying. I think I've found a couple games that I do not mind investing quite a bit of time into. between this and Outer Wilds, I might be a Valheim slash Outer Wilds streamer for a little while. <laughs> Which is not really a problem, if we're being honest. <laughs> That's how you do it. Hello, enemy. You can't escape, this is a corner. Yeah, if I'm going to be attacked in this region, I'm gonna be building fences around the house and around the village. They have multiple layers of things they have to break through before they reach me. I just kind of want to finish that back hut that I started, then I'll end the stream. Oh, oh where, where are you going? Good. No. Go. Oh wow, there's <laughs> there's a dungeon right next to my house. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even realize I'm building a house next to a monster dungeon. Can't swing down. Please give the ability of swinging down. I hope they do. Swinging down and better hitboxes for weapons like the the spear 
are my number one request. Those are the things I want to see. Being added to the game. Dungeon house! <gasps> Make a house in the dungeon! Bob, you're a genius! Dungeon house is best house. Because if you live in the dungeon, you are your own boss. <gasps> dungeon boss! Also, <laughs> in a less jokey manner, it gives me uh, multiple tries on the dungeon without having to worry about dying. So... It's actually not a bad deal for me. This tree is pretty weak. Oh, it's too hard. Yeah, that tree was. What's my axe doing? Yeah, it's almost out. I was gonna say. Ooh, look at all this tree. Tree. my friends death by tree I think at this point we have died to almost everything we have died to tree we had died to fire we have died no we haven't died to water yet we <laughs> we're almost we're almost the anti-avatar Instead of having the power of all those elements, we die to all those elements. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna have to get rid of some of these, I'm guessing. Be able to pick this up. I can't, I pick it up. Oh, is it too heavy? There we go. Yeah, it's too heavy. I need to take stuff back. Pig! Pig! What are you doing there? Oh no, it wants to kill me! Alright. I'm gonna put some stuff away. Gotta put some stuff away. Might need another. Definitely gonna need another chest. Well, so this is gonna actually be my chest room. And me too. Pig. Pig. <laughs> What's the pig doing? It's insane. Oh no. Um and I'm gonna move into the main room. It will have a big fire in the middle and chairs around it. And back here will be my chest room. My chest room. Um, so I shall build another chest over here. think they're oh, yeah. actually they're pretty well aligned put this here put this here this here 
this here, this here. Now I have a bunch of wood. I'm just gonna finish. Oh, I do feel exposed. I'm not wearing any clothes. Alright. I'm just gonna finish picking up all the things that I cut up and dropped here. I'm just gonna finish the work I left. Can I pick this up now? Thank you. I love how things just ragdoll like crazy, <laughs> especially if they're not meant to be like used by the player. So the stumps, for example, the, <laughs> the model just kind of away. Too hard. All right, that's enough for the day. Really, guys? Oh, yeah, don't don't mess with the Joe Smithson. He's scary. house soon. Instead of going through the ceiling every time. Alright. Let's see. Ceiling. Let's see. Yes. I'm already on what I want to build. Perfect. Perfect. Look at that. This house looks marvelous. One thing we don't want to have is smoke buildup. So I'm just gonna build the door. Did I make, was I smart and made it uneven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Rods made it uneven. So, one, two, three, four, five, this one. So I can have a single door. I don't need to be a crazy man anymore. Then I forgot how to open a door. There we go. So what we're gonna do... Now... Is... You know, I said stop playing. And we are gonna do that. Today has just been the night of not wanting to stop. I'm okay with that. <laughs> I'm okay with that. I'm just gonna finish building the walls. You've become addicted to Valheim. Yes. From survival hater to Valheim lover. What have I done? Boo. That's all right. we go! 
I'm just gonna put the little wall up here, and that's gonna be it for us tonight. Look at that. Looks great. Looks fantastic. Fantastic. I'm that way too with some games. I enjoy it too much and don't want to stop. Yeah, I think everyone has, like, if they enjoy, even outside of video games, if you're enjoying something, people that really love a good book, really love a good TV show, you just want to binge watch, you just want to, you know, keep reading. I think people are just like that in general. It's just we don't want to stop doing something we love. Oh man, I have the same rain problem here. I'm gonna have to figure out something to do with the rain. Especially as I build this house. Okay, no. And with that, we will conclude the night. Thank you so much, everyone for staying and watching me play both Outer Wilds and Valheim. If you had a good time watching me do these and become addicted to these games. <laughs> and I just hope that you guys, if you guys enjoyed it, you try this, these games and honestly, they're super fun. <laughs> and you know, Outer Wilds is blowing my mind. Hope everyone has a good night. Remember this week, we will be streaming tomorrow and Saturday. So not Friday, but Thursday and Saturday. And yeah, I think that's it. I will see you tomorrow. That, I bid you adieu. Have a good night, Bob. Have a good night, everyone. Night, Kylie.